Still on Prince Will on stage comedy concert, one of the major highlights of the night was when the comedian called up his mom on stage and surprisingly gifted her with a brand new car. I said, you can drop the stage, you to climb the So while I was growing up, while I was growing up, somebody told me, told me, okay, my mom was with somebody, and my mom was speaking Yaba, so you're picking with stop on that, the best time I'm asking, this is one way you go. You don't know what he will do you. This will be like, we will beat you when you don't go. So my mom cried for like two weeks after. I said, don't worry. We go so old. <laughs> you know what I And you know, I've always, I've always told my mom I'll buy a car. My mom will say, now so he brought that tell your own mama. <laughs> Till the mama died, not buy the car. So the one they pay me. Say, so now me, you want this. So only I can get them. Say, I'm here, tell them. They're the people. Who's going to tell had a chat with Principal's mom who couldn't hide her joy. I cannot express my joy. I've always prayed for my son because I know that God has given him to me for a purpose. A purpose that will always be accomplished and this God I've done in his life. This is just the beginning. The sky is his limit. I put him before God so that God will take care of him. So that greater things will be done. I appreciate. I don't think we expect this but I know God will do it more than this one. I appreciate all of you. Well, while hosting his comedy show, surprised his mom with a brand new car gift. In an interview with Hip TV, Prince Will reveals the close relationship he has with his mom and why he speaks about her so much on stage. First of all, my, my dad is late, so there's nothing I want to say about him. He came number two. I didn't really grow up with my dad. I grew up with my mom, you know. Mom, a lot of things happened as a, as a child, but it's just been me and my mom for years. It's just been me and my mom. There were those times where, as a boy of five, six, there are those times when my mom goes through hard times and I'm the only person she can talk to. There are those times when, as a very stubborn worry boy, I'll enter some kind of problem and they say when you run, go outside, outside, no accept you, come back to house. The only person I know I can go to when it all red, as far as life is concerned, planet Earth is concerned, is my mother. So we've come a long way. I know the sacrifices that woman has taken from me. I don't really have a good relationship with my dad so I could, so I could get that from him quite all right. But, I had a good relationship with my mom and I got the best that a son could get from a mother for my mom. And thank God, that's the best gift that Nisha has given to me. She's the finest gift that Nisha could have ever given to me. Thank God for my mom. And what makes his style of comedy stand out, he shared this. To me, it's unexplainable. Sometimes I come on stage not knowing what to do and somehow comedy comes out of it. My own style of comedy is unique because most times I do have to crack jokes. Although sometimes I crack jokes, but... I can gist around something. My start of comedy is it's unexplainable. Even me, I'm not a talker. But I do it different from the rest of the rest people. And that's because comedy found me, you know. I like what I do before somebody told me this can be comedy. So I didn't it's just beautiful in its own style. Thank God for giving it to me.